In this problem, an engineer is reporting on fully turbulent flow in a pipe flowing at 15 cubic feet per second. They know that the pipe is 500 feet long and 1.5 feet in diameter. They also observe a three foot drop in the energy grade line over the course of the pipe. However, they have lost their notes on what the Darcy Weisbach friction factor F is. Calculating this, they find that the friction factor is about X, where in this case we are solving for the Darcy Weisbach friction factor. So the first thing we have to do in this problem is use our reference manual and search for Darcy. This will bring you to page 313 first, where we can get the equation for the Darcy Weisbach friction factor. So that's going to be HF equals F times L over D times V squared over 2G, where HF is the head loss in feet, F is the Darcy Weisbach friction factor, L is the pipe length, D is pipe diameter, and V is the velocity, G will be gravity. So we can immediately start filling out some terms in this problem. We can see that we have a three foot drop in the energy grade line. So that's going to be our HF. So that's three feet. We're solving for the friction factor, so we don't have that yet. We know that L is 500 feet and D is given as 1.5 feet. We do not have velocity yet. And then 32.2 feet per second squared is our gravitational acceleration. This is just a good value to have memorized. So currently we need to solve for V. What can we do to get that? We know that there is a flow rate and we know that there is a diameter. So in this case, it's very easy for us. We can simply do Q equals VA, solve for V equals Q over A. This equals 15 CFS. Area of a circle is going to be pi, 1.5 is our diameter, feet squared, over four, and this gives us just about 8.5 feet per second, oops, which we can plug in to V up here. So if we do that, got 8.5 feet per second, squared. So solving this out, we can see even just with the units that this is going to be feet squared over seconds squared, all of that over feet over seconds squared. So we're going to be left with one units of feet here. These two are going to cancel, which means we are only going to be left with feet on this side and feet over here that will cancel. Darcy Weisbach is in fact a unitless value. And if we were to solve for this all the way out, the friction factor is going to be just about 0 0.08. And that is all you need to do to solve this problem. We have to start with our two equations. We have to recognize that the three foot drop is our head loss. And we have to recognize that we can find velocity given the flow rate and the diameter of the pipe. Uh, but yeah, that's all it takes to solve this problem.